Hey everybody. All right, first one. I've seen this one several times before, and the science is getting a little bit more crystal clear, and what the elements are to make this happen is getting a little bit more clear. So I like doing these high tech ones. Uh, Higherperspective.com slash breathe dash underwater slash forget oxygen tanks. The Aquaman crystal allows humans to breathe underwater. I've heard about this every once in a while. Um, when I was in Florida, they were talking about this needs to go to the Bahamas. They used to talk about something similar to this. Divers and swimmers everywhere rejoice. Scientists at the University of Southern Denmark and Cooperation University of Sydney, Australia have developed an oxygen absorbing crystal that they are called the Aquaman crystal. The material is able to bind and store oxygen in high concentration. The oxygen is released when needed, allowing humans to breathe underwater. Uh, about 10 liters of these crystal grains is enough to pull oxygen out of a room. So basically, the crystals can contain several times more as much oxygen as, as a tank. Uh, I don't see the name of the crystals here. I don't think you're going to see it. But anyways, so this is a huge step forward for everybody. I mean, imagine not having a tank on your back. I mean, I don't know if you've ever gone scuba diving or anything like that. Tried it here and there. It's not the most fun feeling, you know. Uh, I know I'm a little bit smaller person, but that tank weighs probably close to about 60 pounds, depending on where you go and what you use. And for me, it was always a struggle swimming upward. Uh, so this would definitely help, although I, I'm not certain I know everything about it. I have many questions for the researchers. Uh, my biggest would be what happens if you accidentally swallow them. I mean, let's be honest, you, you have them in your mouth, and instead of them being in an, in, a, in an adapter that you put over your mouth, you put them into your mouth. I don't know about you folks, that doesn't seem too smart for the average person, especially those who actively engage in those sports. I, I personally would have put it in a rebreather, just a mask that you wear that you know slides over your face, you fill the whole side with the crystals and you just breathe. You have a little tube that goes in and a little port that goes out. Problem solved. I wouldn't put them, well I didn't say you put them in your mouth, but I don't see any major pictures or videos of this, so I think it's still in the technical phase. I'm sure people are using it left and right, I just don't have access to the technology, nor would I have access to any water, any major body of water to try this. So, thanks.